Good morning everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be walking you through my morning routine. So I just wanted to show you this super cozy robe I just got on my FabFitFun package. Um, it's a summer and rose uh, robe. And yeah, I just want to be in this forever, honestly. But I'm just going to take out my workout clothes so that I can get all set up. And then I'll walk you through what I do in the mornings. So one of the first things that I do when I wake up is drink a glass of water. It is so important to stay hydrated, especially considering the fact that for the last eight hours or so, maybe a little bit less, let's let's hope it would be eight hours, um, but you haven't really drank any water. So your body really needs that hydration to kickstart your metabolism. And in general, it's so important to stay hydrated throughout the day for your skin, your body, everything. Um, and then I also like to use my ice roller. So. I wake up usually with like very puffy skin um so it's so important because this one helps de-puff and also just because it's so cold it helps to wake me up even more um so that's so important and i love it i just go through my whole face especially focusing on the eyes which is usually the ones that are most puffy because i really try to get those eight hours of sleep but it doesn't always happen especially because i have two nice dogs that love to snore all the time but anyway i love them um, so yeah, so I love doing this and then another thing that I do in the morning is I don't let myself go on social media I like to start my mornings very peaceful very calm just focus on my routine and what I'm doing and um, I think it's so important to take breaks from social media and definitely not starting your day with social media So I recommend that I forgot to mention that it is pretty early. I wake up every day at six o'clock. So um, usually on Sundays, I try to sleep in a little bit more, but other than that, I'm pretty much awake early, early on. Um, and so, yeah, now that I did my early morning routine, I'm ready to get my workout done and then I'll get ready for the day. So that workout was super intense. Clearly I am so red and sweaty and gross. Um, but the first thing that I do after working out is wash my face. It is so important to get rid of all that sweat and just yuckiness. So I double cleanse actually. I use the Dermalogica Pre-Cleanse Balm. So first one, it's an oil-based cleanser. And then I follow it up with the Summer Fridays um, Super Amino Gel Cleanser. Okay, so I wash my face um, and I will finish up my skincare routine after I shower, but I always want to make sure that my face is clean. Um, and then I go ahead and make my breakfast, which today I'm going to be making a smoothie. Um, I did share last week the smoothie bowl recipe that I pretty much always make, but I just got a new Tone It Up Nutrition Protein and I'm going to be using that one because it's so delicious. It's strawberry banana protein. So um, just feeling like that today.
so I just got out of the shower. I feel so fresh, so clean. Um, and now I'm going to dry my hair. Um, so I use my Dyson Air Wrap. I truly only use this one to just like dry it. And then I use the brush attachment to sort of like straighten the hair. I, to be completely honest, have not gotten very good at the curling attachments yet. I just need to practice more, but um, yeah, time to dry my hair. So the cool thing about this is that you don't have to fully, fully dry it um, with this attachment. You just have to dry it a little bit so that then you can put in the other attachments and you'll finish the drying process and styling at the same time. So I'm just going to take this off. You just press down this button and you choose whatever attachment you want and you just put it in and that is all. Now I get to use this one. Okay, so now that my hair is all ready and dried up, um, I can move on to my skincare. So I have very sensitive skin with rosacea. So a lot of the products that I use are to calm that redness and just really help hydrate my skin and make sure that it doesn't um, get irritated by, by products with a lot of um, fragrances and things like that that I'm trying to avoid. Um, so I start with the Summer Friday CC Me Serum. I use about two pumps of this. I mix it in my hands and then I just like gently pat it on my skin. After the CC Me Serum, I move on to this cream, which is actually specifically for rosacea. So I use this mostly around my cheeks, which is the area where I get the most redness. I put in just a little bit, and again, also lightly, just like tap it onto my skin, focusing on the cheek area where I get most redness. After that, I move on to this Murad. Um, this one's actually new. I started using it about a week ago, so I think it's still too soon to tell. But it's supposed to help um, just like boost collagen and make sure that like you, you know, not that I have wrinkles or anything, but um, just like reduce fine lines and things like that. So I want to focus in areas where I'm most likely to get wrinkles or fine lines, which is my levens and then like around my mouth because smiling, you know. Okay, so after that, I move on to my moisturizer, and I actually combine it with this Bare Defense Booster from Dermalogica. It's from their Ultra Calming line. So what it does is it protects my skin, and it really builds up that barrier um, to help with like the sensitivity and all that. So this is literally oily, um, and it just really, really helps hydrate the skin. Um, I find that it really reduces my sensitivity and my redness, um, so it helps a lot. And then I do love their um, ultra calming line so that's part of it and it's really really helped with my rosacea after that i'm ready for my final step but honestly it's a step that i would never ever skip on and that is sunscreen so i love using the super group unseen sunscreen um it literally like its name says you cannot see it it's not white or anything um i don't know if you can see very well there there you go um and it leaves no trace of it being a sunscreen Thank you all so, so much for joining me as I got ready this morning and I showed you a little bit about my morning routine. Um, on a weekday, I would start working and then on weekends, I just focus on the blog and uh, cleaning and catching up on anything that I wasn't able to get done during the week. So that's what I'm about to go do. But um, just leave me any comments with anything else you'd like to see and don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time.